US President Joe Biden unveiled a 6.9 trillion budget proposal on Thursday, a defiant opening salvo in high stakes negotiation with Congress and Republicans over the debt ceiling and government funding. The proposal, certain to be rejected by the Republican controlled House of Representatives, showed little inclination for comprise, asking lawmakers to bolster the social safety net through a flurry of new taxes on wealthy and corporations. Biden unveiled his proposal at a workforce training facility in Philadelphia, where he challenged Republican House Speaker Kevin McCarthy to detail his own plan. The president proposal would increase funding on a brevy of government program extending the solvency of Medicare, lowering prescription drug prices and cutting the deficits by 3 trillion over the next decade. Even still, the deficit in 2024 would increase from $1.6 trillion to $1.8 trillion and the gross federal debt would swell to $51 trillion over a decade. In a year that GOP leaders have said that they would pursue at least $150 billion in spending cuts and refuse tax increases, Biden instead proposes adding $77 billion across defense and non-defense spendings while increasing taxes by $5.5 trillion over the next decade. Biden's budget is heavy on proposals the White House believes enjoy bipartisan support and that can serve as a platform for his coming re-election bid. Biden also calls for federal funding of free preschool for the nation's four-year-olds as well as 10.5% increase for existing early care programs and a 9% bump for a head start. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.